The heating element in your bathroom fan creates heat for the heater portion of the fan. It's made up of a wire heating element, a thermal overload, a wiring harness, and the frame. After years of use, the heating element can wear out. The wire can break or burn through. The thermal overload can fail. Replacing the heating element is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. The first step is to remove the grill from the fan body. Of course, your fan will be mounted in the ceiling, so this is going to be a little more difficult for you. You'll have to hold everything in place so it doesn't fall. I'll use a screwdriver to carefully pry the lens away from the grill body. The grill is secured to the fan with two screws. I'll go ahead and remove them. I'll support the grill with one hand as I remove the other screw so it doesn't fall. Now I can pull the grill away from the fan and remove the wiring harness for the socket. Now disconnect the two connections on the wire harness. Now I can remove the heater blower assembly from the fan housing. It's secured with two nuts and two clips at the back. I'll go ahead and remove the nuts. And again, I'll be careful that I support the blower so it doesn't fall out when the nuts are removed. Now I just pivot the blower housing away from the fan housing. Now I can remove the heating element. It's secured with three screws. Here's a pro tip for you. Many of these small sheet metal screws use a quarter inch size hex driver. That just happens to be the size of any screwdriver that uses replaceable tips. So rather than using a tip, you can just use the holder. Notice the flange is on this lower part of the heating element. As I rotate the blower around, it's that lower screw that I want to remove. I can leave this one in place. And now I can pull the element out of the blower. Now I can install the new heating element. I'll position it so I can rotate the flange into the housing. Then I'll secure it with two screws on this side and one on the other. I want these screws tight, but I want to be careful that I don't over tighten them so I don't strip them out. To install the blower back into the fan housing, I'll first hook these tabs into the slots on the housing itself. Then I'll rotate it down, aligning the holes with the threaded posts, and I'll secure it with the nuts. And with the blower housing back in place, I can reconnect the wire harnesses. I'll finish by reinstalling the grill. I'll connect the wiring harness and place the grill onto the fan. I'll make sure I align the mounting holes with the holes in the fan body. 
And of course, the grill should be aligned so that the outlet for the heater lines up with the heater blower housing. I'll secure the grill with the screws. I'll finish by reinstalling the lens. I'll align the slot on the lens with the tab on the housing and snap it into place. And now you can replace the heating element in your bathroom fan.